Milos Milojevic, head coach i Mjällby, welcome to my TV. Thanks. Uh, victory in the last match against Skövde. Uh, why did we win that match? Uh, I think we, after the first 10 minutes, then we took control over the game and uh, we had uh, good performance. And uh, if we have good performance, then uh, usually we, we get really good result and it's hard to stop us. And of course, the second half, uh, we were satisfied with 3-0. That, and I also understand that after the heavy trip, so... We don't have to force, and uh, uh, we wanted to score. We didn't. We didn't score from our chances, and uh, like always in football, then you get punished, and they score one goal. But in any moment, like I say, after first ten minutes, the victory was not questioned. Mm. And uh, you have got an assistant coach, Mladen Blagojevic. Uh, describe his role in the team. Uh, it's a. Uh, As as it's now, he has his team Musterlian, so he's maybe not uh, how to say full job here, but uh, still uh, it's good to have four eyes and uh, he's helping with uh, the trainings and uh, warming ups for the games. So it's good to have someone to talk uh, on the bench when it's going good and going bad, and um, then we see how how his role gonna develop and how we can work in in future. But uh, now. Uh, I'm just focus uh, one game in one, and that's that's only what I think. And of course, like I always have in uh, back on my uh, mind, it's uh, back or front, but it's to develop the players and develop the team. And I think we are doing good that on the on daily basis. Mm. And a new match on Saturday against Utrecht Uh Expectation on that match. I think uh, all we players and uh, supporters expect three points, but uh, uh, I'm calling for the warning for this match because these are so-called trick matches, first against last and uh, with Berg with uh, all their history and, um, and uh, reputation behind them. Two last games, the momentum is with them, they're winning the games, so it's not going to be easy, but uh, if we come in the game really motivated and focused from first to last minute, I believe uh, with good performance we can again gain uh, victory and that's uh, of course our our aim for every home game. Uh, and the final question, uh, guess the results on Saturday and who will score in Mjölby? Uh, unfortunately I cannot do that because if I could do that I will be probably the richest man in the world but because I'm really bad in this uh, Uh, I don't do that, I don't gamble and uh, for me it doesn't matter who score, if Hans Larsson can score and we win and they accept the goal, I'm happy with it. Thank you Milos. Thanks.